We have the substitution method and the last, which is the graphical method. But today, the subtopic is to solve simultaneous equation using graphical method. Now, the graphical method, of course, let's go straight by looking at um, a typical equation. Now, when you have equation is a, a, a mathematical statement. It's just like a statement that involves equal sign. Now, when you have any statement like 2x plus 3y is equal to 10. This is an equation. Why? Because it contains equal signs. Now let's have another equation like 2x plus let's say 4x plus 2y is equal to let's go to teacher, teacher I'm, I'm diving because I want us to go fast. Okay, so these are two equations. We want to solve it simultaneously, meaning that we are solving them at the same time together. Now, to solve these two equations, let's make this one equation one and this equation two. Now, we're going to solve this using the graphical method. And what is the first step? Now, to solve these two equations using graphical method, we call something intercepts. We call something intercepts. Now, intercept is where your line it meets the x and y axis. Now we have x and y axis. So we just as the x axis. Now, you see to find the x axis or the x intercept for my equation. Simply set y to be zero. You set y to be zero. So we can say that for x intercept, y is equal to zero. Now when you set y to be zero here, we are going to get two x is equal to ten yes. for the want of time. Yes. And get s is equal to five. Of course, we are we are getting to the point that yeah, we set y to be y was zero and we had x to be five. So the coordinates can be given as five comma zero. Alright, now that is that now let's set 